Hey you guys, it's software. Um, I know that I said I was not going to be shopping until September 1st, but I really have to blame it on Catrice. <laughs> because when she went to Tuesday morning and found the girls papery um paper page kits, I just had to ask her to pick them up for me. So I got the um the girls papery all three of the kits. One the Halloween one which is Toil and Trouble and I got the on holiday and the paper girl kit. So I blame my breaking of my shopping on countries. <laughs> so that also led me to Marshalls. <laughs> and I found the colorful life. Now I had saw this stack, but I didn't think I would ever get it because of the papers but I found a way to get around using these papers as scrapbooking papers so I can't wait to um, use this stack and I got the Nana's Kitchen the Cotton Bloom I never picked this one up from Michaels and I got the luxury stack and this is the new one with all of the new colors these are the new colors I never did like this stack with the other colors so I like the colors that's in that one and then if you can look here I headed off to Joann's and I picked up all this paper all this paper is Tim Holtz Distress Papers. You guys, it's on sale, five for a dollar. Better to get it this way than buying his 36 pack of papers. So that's why I picked up that. And also while I was doing I picked up the Kelly Panacci stack, the Halloween. So I picked up that and I also picked up one of those thin goblins. This is just the card stock um, pack, but I also got the glitter stack. And I mean every sheet has some glitter on it. This is gonna be an awesome stack to work with. And yes, I actually picked up two of those. I also have the mat stack and I also picked up this stack right here which is the Tahiti beach stack I actually picked this up to work um, on a mini that I am working on for my boss she just took well within the last two years she has taken trips out of the country and she has some pictures for me to scrapbook for her. She doesn't know what I'm doing, but I'm going to make a mini using that stack. And Joann's also have all of Tim Holtz items on sale, 40% off. And I also had an additional 20% off coupon. So I picked up his facets. I picked up some more game spinners and I picked up these photo corners well corners angles I have never had any of these so I took advantage of the sale and the coupon and I picked up two of them I picked up his accoutrements I really like these these are awesome and I picked up another set of sprocket gears and I also picked up since fall is right around the corner and it's my favorite season I picked up two of these 
um, Granite Adhesions by Susan Wingett. And Joanne's also has um, some of Tim Holtz's new, new line. And so I picked up the Jalopy and I picked up the Weathered Clock. I've been wanting those two. Those were the only two that they had left at the moment, but I like them. So I picked those up. And I picked up a tissue tape dispenser. And I picked up the new tissue tape. It's called Sketchbook. And it has butterflies on one roll. And the other roll is um, script, it looks like. But I thought that was real cute to go with his um, new stack. The butterfly one. The um, craft resist paper. And then I picked up the pen nibs. I do not know what I'm going to use those for. But they were 40% off and my 20% off coupon. And I also picked up some of these hanger clips. And that's it for Tim Hope products. But also while I was at Joanne, and you guys know, I mainly collect these. I probably will use them every now and then, but I mainly collect these um, little stamps. And I love them for the size that they are. So um, Inka Digga Doo has these new um, ones out for Halloween and fall. So I have this one. And I have this one. This one. And this one says Happy Halloween. Trick or treat. And this is a skeleton, which you can put him in any direction you want. This one has candy and Dracula teeth and candy corn. And this one is really cute. <laughs> that cat is cute. And I have this one. I've never been to a Halloween party, so this would be good if anyone goes to Halloween parties and stuff like that. This one, I love this one. And I got this one. And this one. And this big eyeball. That's, that's cute. <laughs> and this one. And this is the last one. So I picked up that. And also, I picked up the embellishment stack to go along with the Ghost and Goblins paper stack. And it has three um, different sheets. So I picked up that one. And I also picked up the one for the Harvest Gathering stack. I didn't get that stack yet. I'm going to get Halloween stuff first. So I picked up that one. I eventually will get the stack. I only picked it up because it was on sale and I had that additional 20% off coupon. Because this regular price is $9.99. So. And I picked up the die cut card stock pieces to go along with the Kelly Panache stack. And I also picked up. This Memento ink pad. And this one. In the brown. And I picked up the border. The border pieces to the Kelly Panache stack. And one time when I went to Michael's, they had these on clearance for 99 cents. So I picked up those. And also at Hobby Lobby, while I was there, I picked up this Memento ink pad, and it was on clearance for $2.99. And I picked up this one, and it was also $2.99. And I always pick up their scrapbooking idea magazine. This is a Hobby Lobby, a Hobby Lobby magazine, and it's only $1.99. So, 
every quarter they come out with one and I always pick it up I haven't been to Hobby Lobby in a while I think I missed the summer one so I'm gonna have to go back and check and see if they have a summer one but the Hobby Lobby that I went to this was the only one that I saw but it gives you a lot of ideas and I think I think I might either uh, even enter in to send in something for this little magazine and the last thing I did was I went to Staples and I picked up the 6x9 um, envelope because that's what I'm going to use to make my mini with alright you guys that's my haul and I hope you enjoyed thanks for watching